Hey, how's it going? So clarity, it is time to get focused because the more focused you are, the more you're going to practice the actions that are going to help you get results, right? So my name is Brooke Oaks. If you are new, please say hi. Let me know where you're tuning in from. If you have joined me before, it's good to see you. Say hi as well so I can say hi back. Clarity. How can you gain clarity in order to achieve better results than you currently have? Um, you know, I have talked with several different people. Um, I've got a couple different mentors and each one um, helps me with different things, right? So, and we get tied up in doing all these things, right? You want to be posting here, you want to create content there, you want to talk with people here. You're busy in all the things. Maybe you've got a blog, an email list, so many different things, right? So if you aren't focused, you are not going to be able to get traction in anything, right? The only way that you are going to climb that ladder is to start taking the steps that you need to take, right? So what can you do to gain clarity? For one, I really hope that you have set up your vision, identified your vision, what it is that you want to achieve in your business, right? Um, or in anything in general, you need to have a vision. You know, you hear these stories of people who go from nothing to amazing things. Um, but the big thing was that they had a vision, they had a want, they wanted to get somewhere. A lot of times it takes a lot of failures. Uh, but if you're clear on your vision, those failures are not going to hold you back. If anything, they're going to help propel your you forwards because you know what it is that's not going to work so you can try something else to see if that's gonna work right so have a clear view of what your vision is and identify the action steps how are you going to get there whether you've got a monetary goal a health goal um, how are you going to get there what is something that you can do every day to measure how you're getting there so identifying what it is, those skill sets that you need to be focusing on is super important. So a big thing with me is I use my blog and my email list. Um, you know, I've got, hey, I've got a lot of people who um, go through my blog, love to see my story in there and hear different things that way, but some people prefer to go into seeing what goes through my newsletter because the information is going to be geared a little different, right? And But you have to be clear on what it is that audience wants, what it is that you want to accomplish. Because if you're speaking to everyone, then you're not really speaking to anyone because no one's going to want to listen. They're not going to feel the emotion. They're not going to feel the relationship. They're not going to feel the connection. So the more clear you are on yourself, your goals, your vision, the more that you can actually pinpoint what it is that you want to do to get attention from the people who are interested in what you're doing, right? Because that's the big thing, especially network marketing. You know, you are putting out your flag. You're saying, this is what I'm doing. This is where I am. And you're looking for those people who are looking for you because you want those people who are interested in the same thing as you to raise their hand and say, hey, what's going on? I want to know more. And so being clear on what your message is, what you're doing each day is very, very important because you're going to make it easy for them to identify what it is that you're doing, right? If they can't identify what it is that you're doing, they're not even gonna know what's going on and they're gonna go to someone else who maybe they're drawn to more because they can understand the message. So having a clear message as you're creating your content is a lot easier to do if you've got a clear action plan and clear goals. So planning tends to be a little bit difficult and I completely understand that, right? Um, especially when you've got a lot going on. But if you actually take the time to make something that fits into your day, it's going to be much easier for you. So identify what it is that you can do. Maybe it's a post on Facebook or a post on Instagram. 
maybe that's your daily habit along with other things that get more people talking with you, get more people engaging with you, right? Because you want those people to reach out to you or you to reach out to them. So you're developing those relationships. And then as you're developing those relationships, they're going to be like, well, what's this about, right? So I found out some really cool information and I just wanted to let you know about it. Um, so that uh, course that my mentor has been doing, they actually opened up until Wednesday um, and they're going to be giving more information on Wednesday. So if it was something that you're interested in learning more about, I will post the link for that um, after the live and you can access that uh, in the comments and above as well. Um, but you know, the reason that I love hanging out with my mentor and learning from her is it's all, she makes everything very easy, very clear. You know, sometimes when you work with someone, a teacher, a mentor, a coach, you feel like they're pushing you in a thousand directions. And my favorite thing about my mentor is she gives you one clear goal, one clear way to go, and you're not going to be focusing on everywhere. And she just, she really helps me focus on my own intentions, my own visions, and where I want to be and where I want to go instead of focusing on like a thousand other things right because going after all those different things hey you're not gonna have time for it because other things are gonna come up you're gonna get through like a quarter of your list and be like well I'm just gonna have to put it off to tomorrow um, and B the more intentional you are with your actions the easier it's going to be for you to be able to get the actual engagement, get the actual visibility, get people talking, right? That's the big thing. The more people you can talk with, the better it's going to be for you. Because networking is all about those connections. So if you've got some value from this, feel free to share. Um, I really hope that you have developed a clear vision, a clear goal as to what it is that you want to accomplish for this year because you need some direction. If you're throwing rocks, you don't know where you're going to end up going. So get your clear vision set up. Know what direction you want to go and start working in that direction instead of in a thousand directions and hoping that something's going to work. Be clear on what it is that you want to do, where it is you want to go, and raise that flag so other people can find you. I hope you have a great night, guys. Thanks for joining.